Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Kelly Swoop. A 19 year old man is in police custody tonight for the shooting death of a 17 year old near the Inner Harbor last week. Now, as we learn that news, the family of the teen victim remembered him with a vigil tonight. WMER 2 News is Jack Watson with them at a special celebration of his life. Jack. Well, Kelly, family members tell me Devron Tyner was reserved but had a lot of personality. He was in the 11th grade getting ready to be a high school senior and his life ended far too soon last week. He was a good kid. I can't express it so much that he was a good child. Parents, uncles, aunts. You'd be hard pressed to find anyone in Devron Tyner's family with anything to say to the contrary. I want to them to remember Devron as a stand up young man. Mm -hmm. He was a good dude. Stay out of trouble, stay to himself, stay with his friends. Mm -hmm. He loved his family. That's why I hurt so much because he's a special child. For Devron's family members, it's been a trying eight days. At the beginning of last week, they found out Devron was the victim of a shooting near the Inner Harbor. Police believe he was being robbed. He was 17. 19-year-old Dewan Cole turned himself in on Monday. We definitely, of course, go to court and everything, but hopefully justice is served in the end all the way. Family members tell me they are trying to take each day little by little. On Tuesday night in Baltimore, a chance for those who knew him to remember him some wearing buttons reading in loving memory. On a trifold cardboard poster, dozens of signatures and messages from people in Devron's life. My life will never be the same, but I know he will always be with me so I can carry his love and legacy along the way. He was a great child. On Holland Street in Baltimore, it's a somber goodbye, but also a celebration of life. Candles and embraces to be sure, but music and smiles as well. A send off to a beloved son, brother, and nephew. We had great plans for the future, you know. Um, but overall, I just appreciate the aspect of being. I'm proud of my son. I know he's an amazing young man, and I'm proud of who he was becoming, and I will keep his name alive forever. According to police charging documents, there were four other men with the suspect, Cole. As of now, it's not clear if anyone else will face charges.